This is Nick, and in this video, I'll demonstrate tweeting with images. Tweets you make through the SRM suite have the option of including a photo and a link, and I'll be showing you how to put that together. So here in Publish, I'll go to create a post. We'll name this post Memorial Day Specials. Since we only want to publish to Twitter, I'll deselect the Facebook and Google Plus option. Now let's enter the post content. Come by for some great Memorial Day specials. Don't miss out on the organic peaches and watermelon. Great way to start the summer. We have six characters left. Next, we'll go to add media. We could upload a new image, but I'll use this existing photo of peaches. The photo should appear in the preview. If not, scroll down to your social network settings for Twitter, and make sure to check this box for displaying photos and tweets. You'll also notice that our tweet is too long by 17 characters. This happens because Twitter automatically adds the photo URL to the tweet, so we'll need to make this post shorter. If you'd like to include a link, you can paste the URL in this box. This can be any URL you want. Publish will automatically format the link for you and include it in your post. Just be sure not to exceed Twitter's character limit. When you're ready, we can go to the Review tab and make sure everything is correct before we finally publish the post. There's the URL, and there's the photo. We're all set to publish now. Here's our post in the post grid, and here it is on Twitter. If we go in for a closer look, we'll find the image, the URL we included, and the URL for the image. If you'd like more information, our documentation can be found here. Or, if you'd like to see more demos, you can find those at our learning library.